Jason, I tend to think that play calling is overrated. Now, when I say that, people jump all over me. That doesn't mean it's not important. It's extremely important what plays you're calling, what schemes you're running. But fans just basically tend to, not every fan, but tend to just if the plays don't work, well, they're bad plays. Those, that was a bad play call because it didn't work. If the play works, you could run a dive right every play. And if you block it and it works, then that's a great play call. There was talk after the Duke game that you bring in this hot shot from TCU, Garrett Riley, who did all these good things there, is considered one of the bright minds in college football on that side of the football. And either he's not as good as he's supposed to be, or he's being forced to run the Clemson offense, and he's basically just calling plays. I'll start by saying this. Does anybody really believe that Garrett Riley comes to Clemson if he's not given the keys to the – the keys and handed full reign. I don't. I've been told that would have never happened. Um, it's his show. He's calling the plays. They installed. I, I've heard all that. That is run. They, they're running the same offense. Yada yada yada. I've been to both games. I've sat in the box both games. I've seen the differences. There are noticeable differences in the schemes. Clemson went five wide last week. I can't remember the last time Clemson went five wide. They used a couple bunch formations. I can't remember the last time that's happened. It's something I wouldn't notice, but I've been told that the, there, there's spacing along the offensive lines different. I can even see the route concepts are different. It's a different scheme. But, man, when you start breaking it down, the, the counter is the counter. The zone's the zone. The draw's the draw. No matter, you, you know, you can dress it up however you want, but at the end of the day, it's still the same thing. So, I mean, it you know, I don't put a whole lot of stock into all that. I know people see Dabo carrying his play sheet around and think he's calling plays, but nah, that's Garrett Riley's show. He called the plays. I'm not saying Dabo Sweeney never has any input. He's the head coach. He should have input at times if he wants to. It's his it's his program. He runs it. You know, but that that's Garrett Riley's offense. Um, you know, it, but Dabo Sweeney is always going to call the offense to Clemson the Clemson offense. It's, you know, he was brought in to overhaul the Clemson offense or whatever. You know, it's, it's always going to be the Clemson offense. I don't know that Garrett Riley brought the same offense that he ran at TCU with him. Was that Garrett Riley's or was that Sonny Dykes? Because he's been with Sonny Dykes, you know, the entirety of the, of the time he's been offensive coordinator. I don't know the answer to that. Maybe he came in and installed his own thing. Kept some stuff out of the old Clemson offense he thought was good and scrapped the rest. I, I'm not, I don't know all the specifics, but I see a lot of differences. It's not the same offense Clemson's been running. Always good stuff out of Jason. You can catch Jason's work at allclemsontigers.com. The FAU games uh, Saturday night, 8 p.m. Eastern time on the ACC Network in Death Valley. Then, of course, the big showdown against Florida State, which everybody is pumped about the noon Eastern time kickoff, Jason. Hey, at least I'll be able to get home and watch the night games. <laughs> there you go. You gotta, you gotta so it works out for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. They they do still, uh, you know, the, the field's still 100 yards long, plus the end zones and 53 yards wide, and nothing changes noon. I, I think there are big games every week at noon, 3.30, prime time. I get it. Clemson fans want that extra edge, raucous crowd. Everybody's fueled up and fired up at that time of night. Get it. Totally get it. But uh, I think the players, once you know, they get. Game day probably would have been there, too, had Clemson not lost. Too. You know, you, yeah. not only a night game, you're talking about game day on, on location. So you know, it's got a little bit different feel, for sure. Get my picks, everyone. Patreon.com backslash Mark Rogers TV or on YouTube main membership right there. You can do either one on the main channel, get the YouTube membership or on Patreon 27 and 14 against the spread. Plus we give you a discord link. You can talk college football with everybody else 24, seven, 365 and Jason's picks. That's the clincher right there. You get Jason's picks as well. If I can get them to work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Always good to see you. We appreciate you being here. Uh, enjoy the game this weekend. Always a pleasure, my friend. Thanks.